welcome to the session 3 of adio.net that is is sign up form using window form in CSA. So let us learn. First, click on the file new project window form application and the name of the project is sign up and click on the ok. Yes, here we will have a form in that first we will add a four text box. First text box is for the name to so right click on that text property name sorry we will select the name property that is txt name there is no requirement of text property is now and select the font bold and the size of the font is 14 now open the text box and paste it and again go to the property change only name property the second text box is for the email the txt email then after again paste it name of the third text box that is the txt cno sorry txt pwd that is a text box for the password and another one that is a txt cpwd means confirm password and take a button the text property of that name property of the button is bt and sign up bt and sign up and the text property will set that will display in the window form that is a sign up okay now we will take a four label for each text box first we enter the name so text property of that is name and select the font the size of the font is 40 and select the bold and click on the ok now control that and copy that and paste it and change the text property the second label is for the email id so set the text property email next again go to the properties for the password and the last one is the confirm password confirm password and password should be not visible To user so go to the properties and select the password character as a star and similarly for the second select the password character as a star the password is not visible now create a database for the same so to create a new database right click on the add connection the name of the database is sign up this type of database does not exist. Would you like to create it? Yes. Now, go to the tables, add a new table as we learn in a first session, session 1. First, name of the column is name. Second one is a email ID. So, first, name. Then, after, email. Then, after, 
password then after c password means confirm password for the name select the end variable of 50 right click on that remove the primary key again for the email select the end variable of 50 password end character of 10 or we can select the end variable of 50 okay so if the password length is i then there is no chances of exception now change the name of the table the name of the table is a detail and update the table click on the update database okay so four columns are there now double click on the sign up button and there is one event button sign up click so first we are using the database SQL so add the namespace using system dot data dot SQL client and first make a connection object SQL connection com is equal to new SQL connection it has a connection string and to remove the escape sequence put at the rate before the string now to get a connection string right click on the md.md file means database file go to the properties click on the connection string control a control c select whole copy all string and paste it now to deal with that put a con dot open now for the insert query write the sql command sql command cmd cmd is object of that class is equal to new sql command and it has the syntax query and connection object and now type the query to insert into table name is a detail and values values are from the four text box the first text box is within a single cot double cot then after the plus txt name dot text then after comma second single quotation double quotation inside the plus txt email dot text then after the third text box single quotation double quotation plus in that txt password dot text again comma fourth element single quotation double quotation plus inside that txt c password means confirm password dot text these four entries are made in a table detail now to execute this command command dot execute non query for the insert update or delete type of the command and if this query is successful then write the message message box dot so sign up successful and the second argument is the caption of that box that is alert okay and clear all the text box for that txt name dot clear then after txt email dot clear then after txt pwd dot clear and the last one txt confirm password dot clear now let us learn, run the program
enter the name Amit Oma, then email ID er dot Amit Parma. You can raise any query that email ID email dot com. Password I will type the password one two three four five six, but it is not visible to you because it will match with the password characters star. Sign up successful or text box clear. Now let us see in the database. Go to the server explorer, refresh the table, and so the table data. Here we can find Amit Parma, er dot Amit Parma at the red gmail dot and password is one two three four five six and password and confirm password both are same. Okay. Thank you. Hope you enjoyed.